Now the video you saw exclusively first on 10. A man attending services at a Miami Gardens mosque. Police say the same man then later threatened that same mosque. Local 10 News reporter Syra Anwar is live in Miami Gardens tonight with this. Syra. So Nicole and Louis surveillance video from the mosque actually shows that man here praying, mingling with worshipers just one day before police say he went on social media and made threats, even saying he was going to burn this place down. And people are nervous, they got scared, so we had to call the local police. Mosque surveillance video obtained exclusively by Local 10 shows Brandon Hernandez praying alongside Muslim congregants. Those worshipers not knowing he would later threaten to hurt or kill them. Mr. Hernandez. 27 year old Brandon Luis Hernandez appeared in Miami Dade bond court Tuesday morning to face charges of making threats to kill or injure with prejudice of religion. According to Miami Gardens police, Hernandez made threats specifically against the Miami Gardens congregation on Facebook, containing several expletives, saying in part, I'm going to ship your back home one by one with my bare hands. I'm going to burn that to the ground and watch it burn. And I'm going to have your hand with no trial, no due process. Congregants say Hernandez came to the mosque several times for services during the holy fasting month of Ramadan. You can see Hernandez in the red shirt greeting men in the cleansing area as he carries a backpack and here even joining male congregants for the late evening prayer. It's very hard to describe, but it's, it's shocking. Mosque leader Khaled Mirza says threats like this are increasingly common throughout the country and local law enforcement have been a big help. Since that, uh, we have more security and, uh, and our own Congregation members are also watching uh, some newcomers in the in the building. You know. And mosque leaders say they still hope people of all faiths feel welcome here. They're still holding the Ramadan open house here tonight. As far as Hernandez, his bail was set at $7,500. He's on house arrest. He will have to wear an ankle monitor and he's not allowed to come back here to the Islamic Center of Greater Miami. That's the latest live in Miami Gardens. I'm Syra Anwar, Local 10 News. Thank you, Syra.